The Cardiac Cycle, a video to help you explain in a very basic way how the heart beats. The heartbeat or the cardiac cycle involves two stages, diastole where the heart is relaxed and then systole where various parts of the heart are contracting. So just think of systole S for stress. Let's run through the cardiac cycle. So the heart is relaxed, diastole, nothing is contracting and blood flows into the top two chambers, the atria, remember the left atrium and the right atrium. Blood will also now flow into the ventricles, the larger two chambers, the left and the right ventricle, through the now open bicuspid and tricuspid valves. Located in the upper right atrial wall of the heart is a cluster of very specialised cardiac muscle cells. They are known as the SA node or the sinoatrial node, otherwise referred to as the pacemaker. This specialised bundle of cells generates an electrical impulse that passes over the walls of the atria, causing them to contract atrial systole. When the atria contract, this forces more blood into the ventricles, topping them up. After this, the atrial walls relax. When the SA node, or the pacemaker, generated that electrical impulse, it was also immediately sent to another bundle of very specialised cells, the AV node, or the atrioventricular node. The role of this specialised bundle of cells is to transmit or transfer the electrical impulse down to the walls of the ventricles. However, it does so after a momentary delay. So the atrial walls are now relaxed and the electrical impulse is passed by the AV node down through specialised branches in the septum, the wall separating the left and the right side of the heart. The impulse passes down into the ventricles around the bottom of their walls, causing the ventricle walls to contract. When the ventricle walls contract, this is known as ventricular systole. The blood is forced out of both ventricles into the arteries and this build-up in pressure causes the bicuspid and the tricuspid valves to close. This creates the lub sound of the heartbeat. The dub sound of the heartbeat, lub dub, lub dub, is the semilunar valves closing after the ventricles have relaxed. And so completes one cardiac cycle. A very important piece of information that you need to know for your exams is the exact location of the SA node, really easy, the upper right atrial wall, but the AV node is more particular. You must say in the septum at the base of the right atrium and you must say in the septum. So to finish up, let's just look at some labels that are often forgotten by students. Don't forget to mark in the chordae tendineae, the heartstrings. Remember, the role of the heartstrings is to prevent the valves or the flaps of the valves from flying up in the wrong direction. Also, don't forget to draw in the papillary muscles. The heartstrings are attached to those. So if you want to learn more about human physiology, I highly recommend Dr. John Campbell's YouTube channel. He is the most amazing teacher, absolutely superb. So the very best of luck in your exams and your revision. Make sure you're using your textbook, you're doing past papers and checking the marking scheme, you're checking your syllabus and you're always listening to your teacher. The best of luck.